वो देखो वहां पे क्रोकोडाइल है oh, wow, that is so huge. I am in the middle of the second largest forest wetland and also home to the largest saltwater crocodiles over 200 species of birds and a lot more wild animals. I am exploring the unexplored wetlands of Bitar Kanika only on I love my Odisha. मैंने सुना है कि रोड ट्रिप्स पे जाना बहुत लोगों का जुनून होता है और उड़ीसा की बेहद खूबसूरत लैंडस्केप्स ने मेरे रोड ट्रिप जर्नी को और भी यादगार बना दिया आराम ऑन माई वे टू द सेकेंड लार्जेस्ट वेटलैंड ऑफ इंडिया विच इज भीतर कनिका संबलपुर से हमने दसपला और बूथ का रास्ता लेकर भुवनेश्वर को क्रॉस किया एंड मेड अवे टू भीतर कनिका सही में प्लेजेंट वेदर और बढ़िया से व्यूज ने ये एक्सपीरियंस को और भी यादगार बना दिया एंड आई वॉज मोस्ट एक्साइटेड टू सेट ऑफ इन टू द मैन ग्रो फॉरेस्ट नेक्स्ट मॉर्निंग So Bhitar Kanaka National Park is spread across 672 square kilometers of land and houses rare and endangered varieties of wildlife species. And since it's a forest yahan ke stay options bhi kafi humble hai there are small cottages and lodges yahan pe OTDC ka ek chhota hotel bhi hai. The best time to come to this place is around November to mid February jahan pe eco retreat bhi possible ho sakta hai for tourists who come here. But before I take you there let's head into the wetlands. So I'm inside the forest of Bhitar Kanaka. Ye ek unexplored jagah hai aur yahan ka main attraction hai a ride into the mangrove wetlands to capture a sight of the reptiles and animals. I have here with me Mr. Umakant Biswal who's a bird expert and a wildlife enthusiast. Umakant ji, maine suna hai ki yahan pe Bhitar Kanaka mein India ka sabse largest crocodile hai. Is that true? Yes. Sabse bada to hai crocodile yahan pe jiske liye Bhitar Kanaka famous hai. और दूसरे एनिमल्स के लिए देखा जाए तो हम लोग यहाँ पे आप लोगों को मिलेगा स्नैक्स मिलेंगे और मॉनिटर लिजर्ट्स मिलेंगे फिर वाइल्ड बोर मिलेंगे स्पॉटेड डियर मिलेंगे सबसे बड़ी बात यह है कि यहाँ पे सिक्स तरह का किंग फिशर्स मिलते हैं ओके एंड व्हाट विल बी गेट टू सी नाउ नाउ लेट्स मूव आई सी ओके लेट्स गो So we have come to the Dangamal jetty point jahan se hum boat lekar wetlands ke andar jayenge it's ideal ki aap boat ki bookings pehle se hi kar do depending on what kind of sighting you want to do as well So to get the best sighting of the crocodile we have to take a 2 hour boat ride inside the forest and the drive is absolutely beautiful Bitar Kanaka river in the middle of like greenery and greenery and a lot of rich flora and fauna भीतर करने का बेसिकली एक डेल्टा पॉइंट है जहाँ पे रिवर और सी दोनों एक साथ मिलते हैं और ये पूरा का पूरा फॉरेस्ट सिर्फ मैनग्रोव से ही कवर्ड है मैनग्रोव आर बेसिकली ट्रीज दैट आर ग्रोन इनसाइड ब्रैकिश वाटर व्हिच इज अ मिक्सचर ऑफ स्वीट एंड सॉल्ट वाटर एंड देर आर ओवर नाइन्टी टू स्पीशीज ऑफ मैनग्रोव इन द फॉरेस्ट मेकिंग इट द सेकेंड लार्जेस्ट इन इंडिया Wow, that is so huge. It's almost like 15 feet, a little bit more. How do we get to know, uh, you know, the size of the crocodile? I estimate that three type ka method hota hai. Uska skull jitna length hoga into 
टू से मॉडिफाई करने से उसका बॉडी का लेंथ निकल जाता है और एक उसका जो पीछे वाला पैर वो 50 परसेंट में होता है क्रोकोडाइल लाइफ स्पैन एट टू हंड्रेड ईयर्स मिनिमम लाइफ स्पैन होता है Bhitar Kanika, the word itself, uh, when we just uh, divide it, uh, Bhitara means inner and Kanika means beauty. So Bhitar Kanika literally translates to the inner beauty the forest has. It's the second largest mangrove forest in India with around 200 plus species of birds. We have around six plus kingfishers here in Bhitar Kanika and you just take a boat ride for three hours, you can see all of them. It's so common over here you get around 20 to 23 feet long crocodiles and I don't think anywhere in India you get such long and such big huge majestic crocodiles around. We have the huge king cobras over here ranging from 18 to 20 feet long and you can just see them when you just travel in between the creeks and uh, explore you can get to see them moving around. Every time I come here nature never disappoints. It's beautiful over here. Well, to capture the inner beauty of Odisha, well, this is what it looks like. And what better than to watch these reptiles basking in the sun in their natural habitat? Well, nature truly doesn't disappoint. And once we were done exploring the wetlands, we visited the mangrove nursery and the crocodile hatchlings, where se aap baby crocodiles ko apni natural habitat. Mein dekh sakte hai. It was a wonderful experience into wilderness. I crocodiles ko itna up close and person pehle kabhi nahi dekha hai, so that was great. And now to add on to the picturesque beauty of Bhitar Kanika, let me take you to the eco retreat of Bhitar Kanika that's happening here at Pentha. So follow me. retreat at Pentha Beach in Bhitar Kanika. It's a virgin and unexplored beach and the vibe here is like a breath of fresh air. Luxury tents overlooking a white sandy beach. I'm gonna go for a cycle ride to explore this beautiful property. Let's go. Escaping from the humdrum of the busy city life, the eco retreat at Pentha Beach is absolutely breathtaking. And after a wonderful morning inside the Bhitar Kanika National Park, coming back to luxury and beauty is just what any traveler would need. Ending my day at the beach, riding an ATV into the peaceful sunset. Well, all in all, today's experience in Bhitar Kanaka was absolutely wonderful. But this is not the end because on the next episode, I'm going to take you to the mighty and mesmerizing jungles of Simlipal. So stay tuned with me, Bianca Saurashtri, only on I Love My Odessa.